Good morning. Um, this is our two latest two birth van, which I think you'll find is really fun to drive. It only seats two people, plenty of room for each person. And as you can see, it's pretty comfortable for two people. We've got a fridge, a little cooker, sink, uh, plenty of storage above my head and below. Our usual sort of trick to hide stuff in here. Um, as you can see, so we've got little pots, pans and things like that in there and uh, yeah, loads of space to, to do all this stuff. Um, this is our unique little arrangement for uh, pulling out a double bed. Um, we have a very nice little table here, which we slide the surface of upwards, around here. We pull this out, and then just pop that on the floor. Um, pulling out this bed, it's quite easy, usually. Um, just got to pull the mattresses up slightly. And you have a lot of storage space underneath at the same time. Reach up for it and just flip it and put it slightly more. And you've got your double bed. A little bit of love goes a long way. And uh, it's very comfortable indeed. Um, so, what else have we got in this van? How tall uh, is it? How tall is it? Again, it's 6'4, uh, so anybody inside of my height can stand just about quite comfortably. <laughs> um, so yeah, let's put this back. I do really. This one has windows all the way around. It has windows no. all the way around. Yeah. yeah. 360. It's quite easy to store to pull out your duvet and things like that on a daily basis. Um, and then all you do is fly back the cover and put the mattresses down. And while you're driving, we suggest you uh, you put the table leg in and and, up, and then it's ready for a nice cup of tea wherever you were. Uh, Decide to stop. The water is kept in here, so it's nice and clean, out the way. Big 25 litre water, and the pots and pans. Pots and are pans. Here, you put magnets, magnets on so they stay, and of course the all important kettle. Um, under here, there's just more storage, and here we have our sealed gas container. For those of you who travel. Uh, slightly longer distances and are touring, the fridge is lovely, otherwise it's just a, a really nice box because it does discharge the battery, so the stationary periods without a, a lock-up, without a hook-up on a campsite, um, isn't really feasible uh, unless you're driving every day. Get so some air in. The same as all the other vans. The same as all the other yeah. vans, exactly. Get some air in, nice little simple windows, keep them open when you're driving if you like, but this van also has air conditioning so you might not want to. Uh, you might want to get the best out of your air conditioning when you're driving. And this is the, this is the electric system, the usual. Just turn it on, tells you how full the battery is, and then you've got your light fittings, and you can just turn them on um, for as you will, as you wish, and uh, nice and simple. Right, and the electric box is in the, the back. Electric box is back here. So if you open it, it's uh, it's easily accessible. The key. Yeah, the key for the uh, gas is here. Again, like in the others, we use a 907 camping gas, and it's fully sealed in the box with a vent to the external vent. I'll just go around to the cabin. Yeah, come to the cabin. The nice thing about this van is you can walk straight from the front into the back through the, the gap in the middle, which is quite convenient, especially if you're if it's raining. So these, these cushions can go up, or they can go up against the, up against the side if you want, and you can lean against them. Um, you know, it's really up to you, it doesn't really matter. You can swing the table around, and if, if it's down, um, a little bit of help. But, uh, and then it sits quite nicely, and you can play cards between the two of you, um, before you make it into a double bed, or prepare your kitchen stuff. Uh, very easy, really. It's probably our funnest van yet for two people. Great. Enjoy it. Thanks, Mark.